Hey, how is it going? Today, I'm going to show you how you can send Telegram messages to yourself or other people from your PowerShell script. There are just four steps for you to follow. One, two, three, four. In this video, I'm just going to focus on step number four. So you have to follow step number one, two, three on your own. But don't worry, they're very easy to follow. Now for step number four, let's just click on this link to get the PowerShell source code. On this page, if we scroll down a little bit, you will find all the source code you need. Now let's copy the source code. Okay, we have copied the source code. Let's paste the source code into a text editor. In this file, all you need to do is to change two lines. Yeah, just two lines. Line number one and line number two. Line number one specifies the destination number. That is the number you want to send the message to. In this case, it's going to be your number. Not my number, but your number, including the country code. Now let's say if you're from India, the country code is 9191. So you need to specify your number, including the country code. All right? By the way, I'm just making this up, so don't use this number. Use your own number. Now, for the second line, um, you need to specify the content of the message. Um, I'm going to say PowerShell is fun. All right. Now, let's run this script to see if the message will be sent right away. Let's do it now. To run the program, all you need to do is to fire up a PowerShell console. You do that by going to the search button and then you just go to search for PowerShell. All right. Now, the way to trigger the program is very simple. You just type in the name of the, of the script. That's it. Now, let's run the program. All right, the message has arrived. PowerShell is fun. If you also want to have some fun, give it a try for yourself. I'll see you next time.